For those of us who haven't heard this story, there was a, uh, a very famous discovery in the 1980s from two researchers, Barry Marshall and Robin Ware, both in Australia, and they were physicians and they had this theory about um, peptic ulcers being uh, caused or associated with a, a type of bacterium. In this case, Helicobacter pylori. They had a, a research grant, as, as researchers yeah, often yeah. do, to, to investigate this thing. And they were looking at, look at 100 patients, and they're doing uh, swabs, oral swabs, of, of people who presented with peptic ulcers. And they're trying to culture this bacteria. It's a fascinating story. Uh, and in the first 30 patients, the swabs would come in, and they didn't, they didn't detect the bacteria in this, mm -hmm. in this case. But on the 30th, they did. And you know what happened? This is no. crazy. So helicobacter, as, as a microbiologist, you'll appreciate mm -hmm. this. They are micro aerophiles and they, they don't grow well in oxygen, not mm -hmm. like us. And they have a really long growth period. So in the first 30 cases, mm -hmm. the the organisms were, you know, as, as we do in a microbiology lab, you grow them for 48 hours, you don't see anything, <whistles> throw it in the garbage. On the 30th one, happened on a Thursday, let it grow to 30, 48 hours, and of course, that's the weekend. Went over the weekend, <laughs> and on Monday they yeah. come in and oh, look. You look back to pylori is here, and so for the remaining of the hundred patients, yeah. they they changed the profile and, and did an awesome discovery, right? Yeah, How yeah. you find these things, mm -hmm. and still contentious, mm -hmm. right? We found the bacteria in this case, and it was, and to prove a point, uh, one of the researchers, I think it was, uh, I think I think it was Barry Marshall, grew up a pure culture of Helicobacter pylori. Wow and said to his colleagues, I'm gonna take a, a swab of my stomach, see if it's there, it wasn't there, and then we're gonna take a culture of the bacteria, pure culture, yeah. and we'll drink it, and we'll see if it causes an ulcer. So, drink it, and then later on, and it's great, and the actual, and the journal talks about him getting bad breath and his wife detecting it, <laughs> and he got an ulcer from the from, pure culture.